and that one's gonna be following uh following the retro redeemed month of June. Whatever I can play and, and toss in there, it'll be like a July kind of a. I'm owing to a couple of mods. I'm owing to a couple of friends some fun um, games that I've been shelving. I want to play like Xbox 360 games on the Xbox One, and then also maybe a little Starfield and some other fun stuff that would be first place for me. Has anybody else jumped into a? Uh, The, uh, the remake for Super Mario a Thousand Year Door. Have you been enjoying it if you have been able to? I think there's a lot of quality of life stuff that goes into these remakes and that they're putting out. Just soundtrack wise, aesthetics, everything's been fun. So I uh, hope everybody has a safe and uh, solid rest of the week, too. We made it to. What is this one? Shiver. I want to call it Shipper Thorn, like uh, a different Kaiser level we were just on. We were at Far Outpost. Get yeah, Far Out! Far Out, Far Out, Far Outpost. Which seemed like a pretty cool place to level up, too, because we were facing off against a lot of enemies um, that were high uh, skill levels. Otherwise, this place just kind of has a dead end to it, doesn't it? Again. Night skies makes me feel vastest of space. Lots of space. Ah, boom. Alright, so they have this big cannon monument thing that I think they just load in bomb to shoot us off into space. This one's locked, but somehow I believe there's a connection to get that out to the moon later. Oh, snap, we're getting moon landings. I mean, face off some more battles. Oh, nice. Nice. Uh, but yeah, we were having some pretty good Mario races, some busy ones. Uh, anything I want to use for that? They're just gonna freak you. I'm gonna freak them to tiny size, huh? I have a feeling that doesn't actually do attack damage, though. Maybe fire? Emotional. Damn. Are you gonna play? Oh, no, she got hurt by just people trying to swing it. Oh, no! Okay, it didn't freeze Mario this time. Okay, that's good. Yeah, but we're getting a lot of XP here. Um, I didn't hear yours play just yet. But for 400 channel points, I can claim that one again and just see what's happening. Down alert. Could have just been frozen for a second. Yeah, we got some extra powered up boosts for where we're at the game. So that's helping a bit. Oh no, we got frozen here. Yeah, I hope everybody's nice going well. Even again for the raid RGB and friends. Um... Oh, we both got frozen. The SNES during the game, yeah, I think I'll, I'll try for that. Um, for the for the redeem of even the, uh, the subs, I will at least get 15 minutes on that one, and I want to say do it at the end of the stream if you guys are down with it. Um, all I was trying to do was find the two characters they want me to get to. Oh. You can go down that far. In. Camera is disabled still. Cross circles around him. Um. 
Yeah, it's almost like the sound alerts one just busted. Oh, we got him enough times. Perfect. That or accidentally disabled my sound alert for a second? I'm not sure. I'll refresh it and see what happens. Sometimes after a certain hour, um, it needs, like, fixed. A wild look indeed. Here's the key in the game. Um, Hats off this Mario Kart races tonight. Yeah, that was a good. That was a good jam. I hope everybody that was here, or even a short bit, enjoyed. You know, catching up, playing some community games type stuff, or even just seeing us get wrecked at it. Take off those flames and set them on fire. I guess you do like a magic spell. Okay, that's a good special attack. Um, but again, guys, uh, hope the rest of the week treats you well. And uh, we just kind of carry on through the, uh, the later half of it. I end up usually working Friday and Saturday nights, so it is one of those things that's hard to line up. A lot of, uh, you know, a lot of collabs that are free for folks that aren't, you know, like, I work on the weekend, so you, other folks won't be available so much on, uh, weekdays, so we gotta swing it the other way with the full lap times. Oh, so this is the other side, to where Vivian was found, quite light now or so. That's a lot of platform. I think it was just for a star piece. Close up the sea stick. It's this guy. I want rainbow. One of the platforms, uh, you can ride up. Ah, walk in that hammer. Okay, rig. Bro, right through the defense of the other one. That's pretty good. Easy GG. Alright, so after I find out um, the one Bob on I think the one I'm after is actually back in. Uh, The warp space for uh, Tupa Tupa Town, the old uh, Tupa Village. And then the other one, I can fast travel back to Coffee Heights. So we got that going. Um, for those that are up late for a moment, I will. Try to jump into Terra Enigma. I think I have. I think I have the ROM of that saved, but I definitely have it on my uh, retro pie. You see, the, the power is on to that, so I just have to switch over the uh, HDMI, the right one. You sleep well. Oh man! All right. A little bit more of my hydration before I gotta unsimplifier. More damage dodge. That's nice. You can stack them, I think. Oh, not with the other uh buying others. I think you broke the redeem points, coins. Uh, you might have. It's okay. 
it definitely um definitely can happen by mistake late night, but it's not your fault. It's not the most annoying one, is it? Space food, we can double dip. Use two items in there. Nice. I forgot we leveled up and grabbed more BP. Do I have any more? Never succumb to a first strike. That's probably useful. We'll just give damage dodge to the partner too. Yo, Shaman Ninja, how you doing tonight? It feels like early morning. Hope the uh, Thursday's treating you well. One shine spark. Um, but yeah, if you ever considered Kaizo, there is the Nightbot message to check out smwcentral.net. You're like, oh, what the heck's that? I do not know if I care about that. It's all fair. This is one. Hee hee hee, chat Ripple's adjustment house. Adjust your partner's ability, so. Think you want to change your abilities or your partner's ranks? Then I come. Oh, can't adjust those things for the low, low price of 39 coins. We can adjust your own ones around. Yo, it's good to see you in though. Um, just had a busy little community night, and the night was dedicated with retro gaming backlog and the community of uh, awesome, you know, collab times. We're gonna try to do that more. As the time goes on, maybe maybe once a month if, if the schedules can line up. Um, again, I won't overcommit. We're both pretty busy dads by the day, so. I think. It was General White, I think it was. I, I think they are retired. Back in the village. Could be mistaken, but pretty sure. Where have I seen White Bob on guy? As the quest. end up in Coopville. That's so far back, but... Oh, that's how I... Hooktail is toast, huh? I guess that's a good thing. Although, well, I've heard that Hooktail had lots of dragon friends, yeah. Much meaner, huh? Yeah, happy free kick off Thursday night pickles cucumber night. You're not wrong, Walter. You're not wrong. The old Thursday... Hype. Um, he didn't hang out, let's say, maybe at a, a bar somewhere? He's a general guy. We've gone through the first six chapters in this game. Now we're currently on the seventh one where we get to apparently man uh, can and go to the moon, but we have to get the bob bombs to unlock it for us. Tell for sure they're not in the opportunities, uh... Boggly Woodside. What's over here? You made your own pickles before. That's a good uh, inquiry. Um, I have not really gone to the extent of making my own that weren't just already pickles in some form. Like, I've tried to make regular pickles I bought spicier adding a different kind of brine from another already spicy set of pickles, like Dave's, you know, spicy pickles and stuff. Um, I've done that a couple times for making pickles, like, spicier in their own right, but... Outside of that... No. Yeah. Good times, though. 
Apologies, I yawning just trying to finish my drinks tonight after having popcorn and some busy races. Oh, sorry if anybody's stuck in an ad for a second. I have a new product, non-sponsored Costco pickles with oh uh, mixed with rosemary. That's cool. Good day to you, Gonzalez. What can I do for you today? What's that you say? You must use the cannon in far outpost to save the world? Hmm. Well that is rather a pickle, isn't it? Hey, we're just talking about pickles. The theme now. Very well, then. I certainly owe you a favor or two, hmm? Yes, should I say? The truth is, I had hoped to resume business with that cannon someday. And just between us, I only stopped because the wife said she didn't like the noise. I mean, that is one reason. Grandparents used to make their own. They would make cucumber ones, typically, but also pickled sausages, peppers, and eggs. Nice! I can say that all sounds delicious. Uh, I've never really had pickled eggs, I don't think. But I have heard. Uh, I mean, isn't vinegar the main base for what you make things pickled out of? Vinegar? Um, that sounds pretty cool. Yeah, and traditional cucumbers, just the way they uh, jar them up, that's, that's a good time. Oh, well, I'm gonna hydrate for just a second while we finish this ad. Sadly, it takes a hefty bit of coin to get that cannon working, so I'll need you to demonstrate just how much you want to use that cannon, or a matter of money. Just how much would you pay, I may ask. Something for nothing, ha, huh? money. Oh, I can tell him everything I had. What, you pay every coin you own, all of them? You are, really? So, oh, really? I suppose I'm just surprised to hear you say that. Staggered, actually. You know that means you'll be left with zero coins, and absolutely nothing. You know that, do you? Yes. I mean, think of it, man. If you spent all your coins, and I mean all of them, you would certainly face a great deal of difficulty down the road. Yes, but hold on. I want to make sure you're doing this fully aware of the consequences. Are you sure you won't regret this later? Absolutely sure. Yes. You really take them all, really? I'll say just kidding later on or any sort of tomfoolery like that? Sure. Why not? All right, then. I didn't have a ton, I don't think. Hmm, well, you've certainly shown me something, sir, so I give you permission for you to activate our outpost cannon. Probably worthwhile to buy gold bars or something instead. Oh, and I wasn't serious earlier, my dear fellow. Oh, could I take your money? <laughs> Shame, I suppose. But I'll return your money. Oh, thank goodness, I had 367. I thought I had like 100 and something. A soldier on, my boy. Good, I, I keep my money. Just did all the side quests uh, I could do at this point in time. Oh, nice! For, uh... At this point in time in... Were you playing the remake of this yet? Or were you playing... I forget, because I, I feel like, um... Even Mario RPG... Oh, you were playing this one, okay. I thought it might have been the other Mario RPG. Full remake, nice. Uh, you've been enjoying it too so far? Unknown businessman, age 30, was taken into custody today by port authorities as he tried to board the blimp carrying large amounts of volatile red liquid. For a few tense moments, authorities identified the liquid as a spicy condiment. The businessman was subsequently released. RDM reports, uh, reporters were mystified by the following unsolicited comment. Buy our new hot sauce, folks! Oh, they got new hot sauce and dogs? Hot dogs? That's funny. Curious shop on the Excess Express. The sales stall. Unique boutique. Unique boutique on the Excess Express. Exclusive train of the independently wealthy. Just reeks of money. Just reeks of... What have we got? A wealthy reeks of money. For perhaps the idyllic landscapes rushing past will loosen your purse strings. Says the impeccably dressed manager of sales. Come on. Come on. Come all. Be you rich or not at all to our lovely sales stall. Then announce a double point sale for all RDM readers to show them the screen in the next 15 minutes. Double your points on your purchase. What? Looking for rookies, advanced level one. Ink pasta, boil fresh pasta. Tell perfectly al dente, mix lightly with inky sauce. Perfecto. Huh. This is the last read of it. Good to know. Chapter 6. I wonder if it's tied in. This is the only way to get on the stall for the Excess Express. 
That's cool. I don't think, uh, General White, the White General bob -omb, is on the train. But we are going to check out the shop stall real quick. As the shop music takes us away. God, it feels like we were just here. Um, apologies, I had the camera light all wonky earlier. Who's this? The sight of the ocean from the window of the train is so very beautiful, I just find myself exclaiming about its beauty without even realizing it. Exclaiming about it. Today's meal will make your stomach shrivel in shame! <laughs> How goes it, Traveler? Welcome to the sales stall. We have lots of souvenirs. There are only three more items. I don't know, man. It's ice storm for now. While Pidgeot appears, good luck with the, uh, I think we're going for Ultra Ball. Ultra Lux, the Ultra Ball. It's a million. Are we getting extra points for these? Good enough shot points. Well done. You claimed your ice. Oh. Good luck with the catch on the uh, other one as well. I thought I got rid of one, but then I got it right back. I was gonna cook the uh, tasty tonic. I think you get something else out of it. Hey, so it looks like everybody got the Pidgeot. Well, you ought to catch the Pidgeot. I think that's about it. I wonder how you pass the time on here now. Just sleep, probably. Welcome. Hey, Walter, is that you? Thanks for the Kirby sub degreeting. And how is the night going for everyone? Even if you came in with a raid or a late night, just call it. Hope you know you're appreciated. Anybody hits that follow button, it means a lot. Toss a spicy chip your way. Uh... Engine passengers. I was just reaching out to uh, one of my mods that said they sorry they couldn't join. That's totally fair. I totally understand that. Attention all passengers, this train will soon make a brief scheduled stop at Riverside Station. Nice on the Pokedex so far. 567. I think I've got... around 700? 662? I'm approaching 700, which is kind of a big highlight. Uh, I had some fun finds on the thrift shopping today. Splinter Cell, Pandora Tomorrow, and God of War 2. Both black label, both complete. That was neat. I found them uh, at the local little thrift place. As soon as they opened, somebody else was looking through them too, and I happened to chat it up, and they were going to take the God of War, and they were like, oh, it doesn't have the manual in it. That's okay. So uh, I got it handed to me, like, you can have it. Um, that and a neat uh, backup headset that's HyperX style headset for like $6.99 games were cheap for like five bucks it was like pawn shopping all over again I think you can just keep going now that we're not broken we're done revealing okay good a nice pokedex is on the flex um let's go so what's another game you guys have been playing in your pastime just to kind of enjoy or get some downtime in? Um, I will say Dave the Diver and the Fire Emblem Three Houses title that I got here have been quite fun. Um, I did clear out Super Mario RPG, the, uh, the remake of Super Mario RPG on stream. That was, that was a good time. I love that title. Um, but yeah, 
Fire Emblem Three Houses I can highly recommend. It's an older version for Fire Emblem, but... Is it just pre-sequel and Star Mourn for you? Also, daily puzzles. Nice. Um, I can respect that. Yeah, it's a good time. I know, uh... Dave the Diver is super chill. And then what was the other one I was thinking of? Oh, Borderlands 2. I haven't been putting a lot of time into it recently because I get fallen into a lot more RPGs. Digital passengers will soon arrive at our final destination, Rogue Board. Okay. I'm trying to remember where uh, you come across General Papa. I think he's like right under my nose. Like he's in the town, maybe? Or like. I want to say not Glitzville. But maybe? No, I don't know. I don't think he's, I don't think he's in Glitzville. Huh. The Star Beast in here. I've really been in the Piazza Parlor much. I can't remember what you even do here. This place is run by Don Pianta. You can play fun games in here and win Pianta poison or Pianta prizes. Give me all the money. Welcome to the parlor. Hey, hey, you're Mario, like the one and only. I know all about you. Rescuing Princess Peach is important work, but even heroes need relaxation. What can I show you? Trade in winnings? Trade in the Piantas. Some of our prizes can't be found anywhere else. Interesting. Oh, that's the way. Come back if you decide. Well, like, I think I gotta trade in my regular coins here, right? I am the Pianta Changer changing machine. I am called Pianta Changer. Pianta Poison. Psst, yeah. It's the gambling ring, right? When do we get... So we need 30 coins for 10, right? You know what I mean? I love checking my scores on this machine after playing games. I'm here all day. What? You see my kids have it rough? Oh, they're just fine. My kids are independent and tough. They can handle it. Her just gambling away. But I guess I should pay a little more attention to them, maybe. Hey, how you doing? What? Me? I'm on top of the world, baby. What's that? What? Why, let's see. What's this? What's this? Scoreboard? Mm. So how do we go underground here? Hey, it's you again. Are you? How are you? How are my Francesca and or Frankie doing, huh? But well, I'm sure I got nothing to worry about. But I just figured I'd ask. Am I supposed to get a jackpot to like get? Oh, that's a boring game. We need to get the seventh for sure. I mean, I'm in the positive, I guess. There's that. Um, I, I, like, you can make a cake mix. You get some FP out of it, right? Uh, but Piantas have, have it. Their own fun breed ever since Super Mario Sunshine, right? Six Piantas, would you like to exchange? I forget how you get that pipe to pop up. You must have to spend a whole bunch here. Old seven piantas for you, Mario. Old seven. Yeah. I'm guessing in the something else barkeep parlor side. Have I done this? The what's behind the wall thing? Oh, I guess not. Okay. Shine sprite there. Shine on. Alright, that's pretty funny. Yet another day dwindles away while I loaf into bed doing nothing. Oh well, but all this loafing starts to depress me. I may have tons of money, but I have no idea how to use it. You probably can't relate to my problems. You don't look rich at all. <laughs> Be surprised. Mario's just flooding with the money. He's defeated so many Goombas and Koopas in the past. I'll never know. 
Um. Maybe our other professor guy might go. Yeah, cake mix. Um, space maple syrup. Maple cake. Make like just a regular shroom cake, whatever. One more item, and we're full up. How we doing, fella? Coconut cake it is, huh? A lot of items in here. None of which look that useful. I'm trying the coconut cake. That sounds cool. Combine some and make more things out of it. Can we cook something for you, clumsy crush a lot? What ingredient would you like me to cook with? The first two. Let's see. Um, but yeah, what we're talking about, it's almost midnight here, which means it's a lot later for East Coast time. Terra Enigma is still on the agenda. Well, real soon. Local candy. I mean, that was something. I'm just dipping in some popcorn real quick. Some thinking candy here. What can you actually make with that, you know? Huh. I think where I've seen him, and maybe it wasn't Let's Fill or something. Almost done, and I'm still researching the mysteries of the door. Oh. I was gonna drop, um, we go hold, we go back down there. This is just the search board. Hey, group, listen to me. So, those are the side quests you might have been talking about, Ninja? Common engineer. We're working on a security code one. You know, the businessman's trouble looks like you're gonna make contact in front of the hot dog stand in Glitzville. Hmm. Oh yeah, so like the side quest you're talking about, was it mostly through that trouble board for side quest? Cool. Um I got all my companions at least on this one, which is cool. That is how you get Miss Meows, I think. Primary way to get him is that question mark. Uh, interesting side quest to do there. But they're all pretty straightforward quests. Um, Well, I'm missing some places that were down in the sewers. It's gonna let you connect to some shortcuts to get like, back to uh what we call like gloomy golds and stuff. But back to uh the little haunted mansion ones, you can get a uh, golden leaf. The best recipe in the game is you can combine is two free items. The golden leaf you can get um behind the uh, creepy steeple side. There's like the house over there for that. And it's like in between some grass break away. Original uh, does not have fast travel, no. Yeah, forget you can do some fun quality of life fast travel stuff. The new one, then. Oh, like the giant sprite you can get to now. Um, 
And then uh, saving takes a little bit longer too of course, to get to a memory card to save it. Three now. Three shine sprites. Cool, we can level up. Oops, man. That might be most of the leveling up we can do. Ah, you're that fellow! So you're the one that accepted my request? Well, here's the thing. Grab the code for the block for my briefcase. When a prototype of our company's new product is inside, this is a big deal. If I don't figure out how to get into that briefcase, I'll be sacked for sure. But that briefcase code. See, I'm a real chair fanatic. Yeah, like anything you sit on. Use the number of chairs in the houses I visited on business as the code. Don't judge me, I know it's weird. You gotta visit those places and pump a chair. Code has four digits. Hmm. The locations of the chairs. First is Croup's House in Pedalburg. Flurry's House in Bobby Woods. This is an interesting one. Don Piano's office in Roadport, Don Piano's in back in Roadport, and Foster Heights too. Here, I know it's a lot, but please help. Remember a chair is anything you sit on. They got spicy hot dogs. Hello there, the naughty egg, a hoggle hot dog, still only 10 points before. This quest. The great Gonzalez I go outside. Oh she, yeah, we helped her uh ease her mind at her. Her brother was okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um yeah, so this is about after midnight, friends. I'm all of it. I'm I'm hitting a wall. Might just do a real quick search, like, what was the second part of this? General White. I think that's all his name is General White. And where the heck? He's asking, where is General White? Is he just supposed to be up in our outpost the whole time? Zero White Rains is a rare type of bob -omb. His actual home is in Far Outpost with other bob -omb, right? Certain you'll find him if you talk to the mayor in Far Outpost? Huh. So if we got the one guy to convince him that we can use the cannon. Now we just gotta go into a previously empty house. That's kind of a play on it. And yeah, luckily, yeah, once you learn where everything's at in the original game, it's not like, too difficult, I guess. And yeah, there's definitely some fun quality of life improvement badges and such as you go. Um, I'm glad they added the like original uh, nostalgia sounds from House Near Door as an optional badge. But yeah. Let's see how far we can get before we have to face off against more fiends. Whoa. Sneaking on by. Oh, there's one. Eating this four. 
Well, there's a good chance we're gonna level up in this. But let's just do Art Attack, I guess. Let's see if we can lock them all in. Honestly, a pretty OP uh, attack if you click on the draw. Literally. Well, there's a huge amount of four enemies on screen. I guess depending on how big they are. Hitbox changes. Um, thanks again to anybody who's hanging late. Let's see what else we got. Upgrades, upgrades, upgrades. Let me talk about doing an all BP run. It's kind of what I'm always leaning towards. You can unlock so much as you go with proper BP. Another defend plus boost more his defense by one. I'm gonna do that instead of the uh, jump man. Just get better defense, and you can still use your hammer on everything. Such a bad idea. What is the fire uh, drives three? Okay. And do I have a quake? One that is worth using, I guess. See quake on here. Quick hammers too. That's good. Let's chill out. I don't need. I guess I don't need quick hammer as much. Where we're we going? Uh, let's do Luigi on Blum. Maybe I'm on the right track, getting an email. Rock, oh, fuck you. Don't call Gonzalez. I'm reborn, you coward. Oh, he's calling me out, huh? Seems to be locked. to this dude. You have got permission to go, Bob. Yeah, now we need General White. I heard he was seen in Pedalburg. You had there. Seen in Pedalburg. I was just there searching for him. Seen in Pedalburg. I wonder if it's going to be one of those cookie trails that you got to sit there and work your way through. Oh, got hit by the other sidewinder cloud. <clears throat> Still do 10 damage anyway. I didn't need the boost to jump in every time. Oh, okay. Six damage. Not bad. Been a minute. I can use the hammer now. Wizard! What's up, Wizard Zo? Random! How was your uh, day going, or evening, or whatever it may be for you? What time you're in? It's just super late here on a Thursday, now that it is Thursday. the cloud. Swipe it on in. Yeah, appreciate you. Yeah. 
six, 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 six. Much better be busy and dealing with some crap. I feel that. I hope, uh, well, the crap gets all worked out on your end, you know? And life is busy as heck right now, for most. Oh, as I was talking about that, you hit with another dude here. Yo, the ads, yeah, sorry about that. The ads snuck in. Sneaky sneak. I'm gonna get frozen by some current. Much stronger than the uh. Oh, weird. You're supposed to just swing it and let go with a fireball. Learning. Dang, this guy can rock some damage in there. I hope you're, what you're dealing with and dealing with uh, through the week is not too rough on you mentally wise. I made it foggy. Awesome. I know uh, it's already a busy enough month as it is. Yeah, we had a random old uh, community night fun time with Mario. And RGB, one of our retro gaming backlog friends, was uh, hanging out. So that was a fun time. Just able to connect a little bit before it got real late. You were swatted, basically? Says so swatted. Oh, dang. That sounds awful. As in, like, that they were called to your residence? That sounds like some, some real, uh,. Bad negative feedback coming out. Now, nobody needs to have that happen to them. Look at the stuff you hear of when uh, people get doxxed and have, you know, bad influential, uh, bad influencers come and, uh, that's a lot, dude. That's a lot of, that's a lot of unnecessary, uh, uh, I don't know, went on you, because you told three teens to stop screaming bloody murder, so there was, there was a, wow, yeah, a lot going on on your plate for sure, I don't, I don't see why the extension of something like SWAT being called, so yeah, I hope you're okay anyway, overall, through that experience. But yeah, that seems unnecessary and excessive, right? So I just chased him with a firearm. Yikes! So that was the uh, that was the blown out of proportion part for that one. Yeah, yeah. Wow, though, people are jerks. Definitely. Like that just seems like wherever you're at. I don't know why the claim would be blown out of proportion, and that the, the fact that they wouldn't, you know reach out to you on normal terms before something like that has escalated. Oh, but is it Murphy? We're looking for General White. Hmm, General, hmm. I've certainly seen him around, but not lately, no. I think he may have possibly said he might head south to a more tropical locale. Freaky Key, was that it? Yep, that's it, that might possibly, perhaps, could be it. 
I think I got some fast travels, I guess. Been pretty shook since it? I yeah, man. Anybody would be. So take your time. Uh for whatever the recovery can be, man. That's like I said, a lot and also gonna be jarring. Sorry, it seems like everything got blown out of proportion for sure. I don't, uh, yeah, I don't get the, uh, unnecessary jump to something like escalating to that level. My folks, but, you know, I won't... I won't take the, uh, the, the, the low side on it, that's for sure, to say that anything like that would ever have been done for right reasons. It sounds like it just went sideways, and that's not fair to you. Uh, do I need to heal here? Okay, no, not really. Uh, talk to the bob -omb, I guess. General White? Yeah, it was her until a second ago. But he took off right quick, said he was going to an arena or something. I am going to be chasing this game in a minute. Okay. That's not very fun. Like there was a something hiding behind this rock. All those bands there, Walter. Yeah. Yeah, I admit, escalated it when they did and was rife, but did nothing illegal to where you was uh, realized on your own property. Well, for sure. Yeah, you get razzed on that side. I don't know, where everybody, uh, you know, where everybody lives, uh, lots of different, different approaches people will take, almost to, like, the extremes of... Why, why would uh, they want to escalate it to an authority thing other than causing a local little huff up about it? Making it way worse, it sounds like, than it needed to be. Nice catch, Walter. Do I have a shortcut? I thought I had a shortcut to a... Uh... Oh, I think this is Boggly Woods. least favorite locale. Um, but yeah, I was talking to Terra Enigma eventually. It seems like a good a good time. 15 minutes uh, of a redeem for that. Blue Sky. I appreciate the resub. Skipping on back to where I'm supposed to be. He's just throwing hammers that don't hit. Hey. Yeah, anybody playing anything fun, exciting, new, or maybe just something to release the stress in the week? I, I, I like a good RPG, so I think we're, we're settling on it. Whatever RPGs can be fun, uh, wrapping up the week here. Like I said, this might be the last stream I can hit up until about Sunday. Um, I keep up with a lot of kiddo time now that my, my daughter's out of school. She's in between preschool, going to be going into kindergarten next week. Skull, I haven't heard of that one in a minute. That's the, uh, the rogue, uh, rogue light kind of got a lot of build up your, uh, your, your weapons and uh, abilities and stuff. That's a cool one. I'm trying to think what to compare it to. It has kind of a simpler uh, attack style. But it's a cool one. Sure, I used to watch a guy who's trying to run through that all in one sitting. No, it's like a speed run, but you know, get the best combination of abilities and weapons and stuff and go with it. What would you rate that game as far as like Rogue Light? Almost, uh, not Metroidvania, but roguelike, you know, each time you play it, you kind of learn something about what to get better at your, uh, enemy fighting. Because I know the bosses in that kind of remind me of, um, what's the bug tail one? See, I don't play a lot of those ones enough. They're either roguelite or Metroidvania. So we give it an 8.6 out of 10. Yeah, it's pretty good rating, right? Warhammer 40k. That's awesome. Um, who to talk to? 
about this. Do we need a barkeep for another Bobo? Just try to trick people. I'm gonna go to the arena. I'm guessing talk to any other Bobo when you see him. General White? Oh, you must be that white Baba, huh? Yeah, he used to come here all the time, but I haven't seen him lately. Now that I think about it, I think he headed off to some huge tree. Or not. What an interesting wild goose chase we get stuck on. See, this is the reason why the, the fast travel would be ingenious. I don't even have the, the pipe active, I think. I do, I'm missing something. Or it's off on the left, and I just haven't gone through the right pipes to take the fast travel part. Yeah, as late as it's getting, uh, I'm just finishing up my melted out rum and coke. Mostly just coke and water. I hope things get better for those before they get, you know, worse. Obviously, Wizard, yeah, nobody deserves to go through what uh, you went through this week, right? This just happened earlier in the week. Yeah, just uh, unfair overall. When um, the things of the public side should not be handled, I think, to that extreme. Unless there's more than a problem. You know? Skulls are great with progression, and uh, in all skulls can be upgraded. Oh, okay. Hey, over here. Here. What's up? Hey. Randomized items for characters. Oh, we're a huge amount of friends. Skill or Thanks bend. for trusting your company over here with Nerdy Old Slayer. Thank you for joining us. How's it going? Soon, let me give you a shout out. Uh, I am Slayer up late night with the OG Paper Mario. We just switched up from a Mario Kart community night about, uh, I want to say, 40 minutes ago. I was Goose Goose Duck. <laughs> uh, we got an orange little rainbow Yoshi themed. All the uh, side characters unlocked, little companions of sorts. I think I'm going to upgrade the last one right now, actually. Goose and. Nice. Lots of cool Easter egg characters to play too. Like Groot. Ha, <laughs> nice. Yo, Ghost Shinobi. Duh, how are you doing? And uh, thanks for popping in with your company. Hey, appreciate that. Um, I am just here, just barely functioning through. This part where like, well, I have a couple here. This mouse. Smooch to boost Mario's HP. <laughs> or oh, Shell Slam. To attack all ground enemies. I feel like I would use Koops in battle more before I would use... But boosting Mario's HP sounds cool too. For later. A Necron from Warhammer 40k. Oh, all that is technically like within Skull. That's cool. Shazubi. Yeah, the Shazubi Shazubi partnered up right here. Oh, uh, almost got enough shine sprites in the game to unlock, or to upgrade every partner. Holy. <clears throat> yeah, I hope the Gooshin was a good old time. The Goose? Goose Goose Duck? Goose Goose. Duck Duck Goose. I don't know about Goose Goose, but... There's some interesting, uh... Interesting game combos out there. You gotta have Goose Goose with Goose Goose. So you get meows. Yeah, I got my meows. And it's funny because uh I just I'm not I'm not gonna use them that much, right? We have them now. I think we were talking about how we didn't have it before. But we have her now. She's uh she's she's just hiding out. Miss Mouse. Yeah, Mouse. Yeah, I, I, I did the little brief uh, chapter for that one, too. Where you go and find that hidden item that she put back within the first, uh... First Hooktail Castle, basically. 
the great tree. Uh, General White? Yeah, he sent an old bob on with this great mustache, but I have no idea where he went. He may have said he was going somewhere dark. Why are we on the tail end of trying to find where this dude ended up? What a time to be alive. I mean, they make you revisit all these places, but for like, no reason. <clears throat> Still, gotta love Paper Mario on uh, the Thousand Year Door for what the time was that this came out. Because 2004 just had such a, such a good variety of gaming. And, uh, you know, lots of fun variety overall. Now we're back out. Go back up. To go back down. Thank you for the like, the good vibes. I somehow I lost my, uh, my sound alerts. For a minute. I don't have them muted or anything that I can see, but, uh, appreciate the good vibes. We will need them. Finish up a little bit. If you already have her good ability, your level 4 can be hit or miss depending on your build. Ah. Gosh, I'm four, like... The final... Shine Sprite steps. I... What are we talking about? Hey, you! You must really like this place, huh? Oh, no, not really? Well, then you must have come to see me then, right? Gosh, if that's the case, I don't know how to say this, but you're just not my type. Ah, oh, you, ah, uh, you, you're Mario, you're a hero, yeah, who's Mario? It'd be awesome if someone said that about you, huh? Yeah, that'd be sweet. Just use the bell at Creepy Steeple. Can I talk to, like, the mayor? He doesn't look like the mayor. Uh, hey, it's the savior of our town, it's Mario. Ever since that pig business, we're on constant guard, but don't think for a second that we forgot about you. I have an important bit of business in this dark world. Good day, I mean, uh, good dusk or whatever. I never know what time it is. It's weird, right? And again, I don't even know what day it is because I never leave this room. Uh, is there something like papery right here? Feels like it. It's just sus. Very sus bills here, dude. <clears throat> Yo, what's up? Yeah, friends, appreciate you. Maybe the crows have my intel. Oh, that's jamming. I'm thinking of starting a new pay site. It's going to be a real estate listings page that I'll call Luigi's Mansion. Hey, that sounds good too, but I think I've heard of that name before. You don't want rabid lawyers attacking you. Rabid lawyers. Huh. Yeah. I don't. It's funny. You know, you can get through anything if you have good memories to cling to, but the problem is not all memories are good. What do you do about things that you want to forget? You can't dump those somehow? Point. Uh, General White? Yeah, I know that old guy. He's a white bob on, right? He was here until recently. What? Where did he go? What am I, a secretary? You look tired, I know that. Here until recently, look tired. Look tired. And he's gonna be at one of the inns, I guess. Huh. That's all we're getting? Dang. What a quest. What are you, just gone back home? Maybe you can sleep it out there. No idea. Truly. I wonder, I mean, I don't think it's RNG. <laughs> but like, for where, uh, there is... Ends to go cash out at. So we shall see. Special refuge for all where we cultivate information. Herb D's place. Come back and enjoy yourself. Ah, 
Oh, that's something you want to ask old wonky, right? Give me five coins. I suppose I can tell you about Creepy Steeple's secret. I guess it's neither here nor there. People get kidnapped, whatever. And that is that. You need to know anything else? Just ask old wonky. I didn't even pay that guy. He just said it anyway. Is this where we get gold coins or gold bars or whatever? Have enough ice storms. To sell the hot dog, because I'm not going to use it for a nice secondary item. Oh, Cradilly is not in the Pokedex. Good luck with any catches. <laughs> is this a special item or oh, three gold bars? Okay. I think you can sell them for more somewhere. Get where? Space food. Um, but yeah, good luck with anybody going for the crowd delay catches. We'll try. Hope we catch something. Is this the one that gets you uh, star piece exchange stuff? Power plus with partner. I can't remember if I ever bought one like that, but. Dang, just escaped. Irem and myself got it though. Walter, just a second late. <laughs> Sorry, bud. <coughs> Item fall. All enemy HP visible. All good, all good rounds. Um I'm trying to think. He's just in town, maybe? General White said they were tired, so they snuck home. Yeah, rats, indeed. Huh. They are different. Oh, yeah, different colored, uh, different colored rats you can choose. Ah, control, file, dispute, claim. F's in the chat, huh? Yeah. Oh, it was, it was totally rigged. Just missed it. Just missed it, though. It's that dude. <laughs> it's not here. If he's tired, he likely went home, right? It's safe to assume. Checked a lot of the other villages, so that's where maybe they would return back to. Unless their home happens to be somewhere else random. This dude's it's rich. He's still just sitting on his bed chilling. I'd like to get this part underway. Only thing I can think of is to go back to Far Outpost and hope if he was tired, he could uh, go back home. Um, thank you anyway for the support tonight and the, and the raid in now from friend Kitsune RS. Definitely go give them a follow if you haven't got the chance to already. They're good peeps, We're just dodging, ducking, dipping, diving, and dodging. They've never made that whole route scotch free. Good times. Bob oh, Village, huh? Give me access back to wherever you're keeping General White. Ah, there you are, you sleepy bum. Seems to be asleep. Wake him up. 
Still asleep, dragon. Still asleep. Sound asleep, it says. Definitely still asleep, dragon. Still sawing logs. Try again. Can it be more asleep? What are we supposed to do here? Counting sheep. You woke. Nah, still asleep. <laughs> Try again. Sleeping like a stash, baby. How many different lines of dialogue? He's not even budging. Still snoring away. Okay, no. Doesn't waking a sleeping person make you feel bad? Not really. <laughs> He's sleeping hardcore. Hmm. What? You cannot find General White? Hmm. Ah, the mustache gentleman. So where could he be? This makes trouble for us. Definitely need him. Otherwise, we cannot even operate that day. Oh, that was supposed to be the hint. If you're searching for him. So, what to do? And he's just behind you, hanging out in this house. Keep bouncing on him. Man, that's all I can do, right? <laughs> just definitely still asleep. It's funny, because you do the hint about, like, where could he be? Is it like 10 tries of this? Has to be. Sleeping like a stash baby. Not even budging. Still storing away. <laughs> I had the good bounce. Uh, System of Down song. Ugh. No. No. <clears throat> no. Wow. Right as rain, huh? Now, who are you? I'm tired. I do not need your attention. I just want sleep. Because it is all hopeless. Bounce, poga, 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 poga. <laughs> yeah, that one. Bounce. Bounce. Hey, hey. I heard Surge is uh, doing a, a collab with a, one of the drummer dudes, one of the major drummer uh, aficionado guys on YouTube. It's gonna be his own like solo song. Uh, they actually featured that song, Bounce, in uh, Secret Life of Pets. I think it's the first animated film I've ever seen a System of Down song end up in. Mustache, that hat, and that hammer even. But, but, I have been looking everywhere for you. Why? Well, to bring that cannon back online, I had lost my life's work, my very reason to live. Found myself at wit's end, and then the rogue port merchant teller told me, seek the man with the red M hat, the one with the hammer and stash. It is a weird movie to use System of Down song, and it's really funny. <clears throat> because it's when the owner leaves... And a poodle, full-size poodle, <clears throat> was just happy, and they're all, like, acting cordial for the owner, right? And then it's one of those plays on that, like, what does your animal really do when you leave? And the owner goes out, and then they reach over, and they hit the paw on the on the radio. It goes, bounce, poke, 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 And they're bouncing on the furniture, and all the other animals peek, you know, they perk up about it. Uh, or, like, it scared cats or something in the house. It was really funny. It was, it was like honestly the best scene in the whole film uh and they just use it for that short like i want to say five or six seconds of the song we'll fulfill your dreams or something like <clears throat> huh? you need to use the cannon to help you save the entire world hip, hip, hurrah! that fortune teller was right so what are we waiting for i shall get the cannon ready so go tell the mayor now get moving hut, hut. All right, <clears throat> well, I'm almost out of liquid, and it's a good stopping point so far. Uh, I'll definitely give Terra Enigma a go. Uh, the next time I get some free time, it'll probably be closer to Sunday, where I'm hoping to wrap this up, and we'll, we'll maybe we'll play some more uh, SNES and the Retro throwback a bit. So, Cannon is back online? Well, I could just explode with delight. Now let us shoot you guys to moon. Yeah, we did it, Gonzalez. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Now, you follow me. I'm gonna get loaded into a shell or something. You come this way. What? <laughs> oh, well, he disappeared off into the next room. I guess we can go. This is kind of one of those chapters that just feels like such filler. It kind of a take away from 
regular story of things, just to do a seeking out rogue mission. Now you stand here. But yeah. Oh, it opened up a gate for me to pull, pull in. General White, is Big Bomb Cannon ready? But leave it to me. Now, man, you know the drill. Load the Big Bomb Cannon. Oh, 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 boom. Now, positions, everyone. Yes, sir. <clears throat> oh, right. The Transformer Cannon back in here, huh? Oh, dang. They are running a bomb. Nuke site. Bring guided system online. Bringing system online. System now online. System check. System check. All clear. Prepare for detonation sequence. Open outer hatch. Big hatch. Fly me to the moon. Open inner shutter. Anyway, fam. Elevate on my mark. He really just got stuck in an ad. I apologize. Oh, fancy. Gotta go in for daddy. Giant cannon launcher here. I mean, I mean, it's big enough. I mean, surely. And they got a lot to brag about, this, uh, this little Russian bomb on Federation. Fighting! Target is the moon! Very fancy. Also, thanks for being here, Bugs and Blue and friends. Uh, I know I said a shout out to Bunker earlier, too. Elevation changing 69 distance. 44 to the moon. Wind speed 1.08. Correct direction 3.03. Correct elevation negative 2.39. Target locked. Chamber hatch open. Appreciate the uh, the reset, man. I really do. You didn't ever have to, but it means a ton. As we go now, everyone in. Oh, <coughs> there are the fire support. Where did all the other bombs come from? This village looks so small. Holy crap. <clears throat> now that's some high caliber bob on Close chamber hatch. Shrouded in here, boo. Stop pushing, I zoom. Oh, 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 you're on my foot. Oh, but look at them just sacrificing all this for the baboon. Stop breathing on my back. Tradition's all green. Stand by, okay. It is time. Big bomb cannon fire. I mean, they're paper. Explosions might not bode well. Yahoo! They were fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. That was so awesome. Good luck, Mario. You're gonna have enough trajectory, I guess, maybe? How do you breathe in space, I guess, when you're just paper, you don't have to worry about it? There we go. Uh, you didn't know, this paper saga really does take you to the moon. Supposedly, it's just a big hunk of cheese. <clears throat> Whoa, that was awesome! Man, who knew adventurers got to do stuff like that? Adventurers? Oh. <clears throat> wow, we're really, truly no fooling on the moon. Let's rock out, Gonzalez. Let's find the last crystal star and save Peach. Like slow motion movement here too. Stopwatch to immobilize enemies. Can I at least run faster with Rainbow Air Gonzalez. <laughs> A little bit. Okay, so if there's a spot to run left and right here, well, at least there's a safe point here. Wow. 
Mm -hmm. Okay, as long as this is like a good save point, I'm gonna like walk me up. For being a different animated chapter, <clears throat> that's a good thing. I always am curious about games like that when they change the pace of things or slow animations down. Is it gonna hurt when we go to load the next time? The wild Wingle appears. I'm gonna try your luck with Pip. Ah. Oh, he's yawning here. Caught me off guard. Did not come across these yet, but I feel like his gold is looking pretty OP. Easy. Alright, good to know. We keep Gonzalez around. Things are things are looking good. Um Space rocks galore. Don't know if we're gonna just keep farming rocks here. Looks like maybe that's the case. I mean, we're on the moon, but it could be that like this whole thing loops around. I guess. Good luck with the safari ball catch. I don't know if that will actually do damage, the, the way the bomb does damage. It might flip it. Just skip it. No one... Not bad, not bad. Oh, I held it on too long, huh? <clears throat> Wait a minute. Um, I guess I'll defeat these dudes and see how we do. Got a lot of high uh fits, right? Alright, you know I did that where I was hoping get enough damage rate. Turns out that was not the case. We'll just get five that way. And... See about Colin. These little rocks are everywhere, man. I don't know if jumping on it was gonna help us any, but... Nope, I don't know Ah, what happens when we do Bob off fast? Just to see. I read all, but it flips. We know they got more than four health. Anyway, um, wait, is it's getting, and getting later. I don't know, I don't know how far we'll be on the moon before we can find the right stuff. The right, uh, I believe maybe it's just hidden behind a switch or something, where we're going to be blowing up some space rocks. Yeah, I don't run them on the moon, man. They're too, uh, too good.
I mean, Operate was a good choice. He got 40 hit points. Pretty good. going, I guess. I think we're finding a little moon base of sorts. Thing on this side, all of it. High air time. Doesn't look like it. Snap dog! Is a snap dog. Meme looking chihuahua. It came from the one I edited for uh, What Do You Meme Family Edition one. Hopefully, we can save it. Way in. By the suspicious building, wouldn't you say, old boy? Do be careful, eh? Just walk right in, man. Hmm, alright. Who's that, dude? Whoa! That's Mario! Let's get him! Another Taco Bell Chihuahua, yo, Piero Taco Bell. Yeah, nice. I like the Taco Bell too. Can't flee this fight. How much health do these dudes got? The dark. It's, huh? it's like Dark Troopers over here, huh? Elite x -Nauts. This guy is the creme de la creme of x -Nauts. Max HP is 10, attack is 5, and defense is 1. He even got defense. He used regular attacks as well as boosting his power or size. Elite x are tough. You just have to smack away until they go down. amount of friends. Thanks for trusting your company over here with Nerdy Old Slayer. Appreciate you, Nerdy. How was your night? Uh, who's that nerd? Yo, oh, it's Nerdy. Heck of nerds. Uh, thank you again for the support. Let me get a quick shout out here. Hate okay. down some elite x -Nots. We're in the late game portion of you know, Paper Mario Thousand Year Door. Um, this is the original hardware GameCube side, so I like to throw off the little GameCube controller to, to match. Um, yeah, we got the Luigi-clad Mario suit, dude. Uh, how was your night? I think you were doing some, some Palia, some Pallying around, right? I know I do get to mod over there. We've been slowly working on some other collab stuff. But we went from Mario Kart 8 Community Night stuff for about two hours, a little over two hours... All right, these extra weebs are here. That's totally it. And the crystal star must be here too, don't you think? 
Peach must be here too. We gotta find her, Mario. Um, yeah, I'll probably have a good time. This is where the beats really pick up, too. Progress was saved. This. I've heard this music before, and I think it was dubbed into, uh. Kaizo. Good, huh? Just got really tired. Oh, that was a long night yesterday and day today. Oh, for sure. Shorter than normal stream on your part? I mean, heck, it's almost 1 a.m., so you did, uh, I would say, a pretty sweet long stream where, uh, where we can, right? Hot as a struck enemy here. Oh, darn. This stuff jumps. I love the timing of those ones. You, you pay for some FP and you botch the first one. <laughs> Good time. Seven. Alright. Well, uh, I think we're going to save it, honestly, here. Because I was telling folks I might try to play Terra Enigma for 15 minutes, but tonight was like, okay, let's get some progress. Let's keep going on the after effect of, uh... the elevator key. On the after effect of, uh... A good Mario Kart community time.